You? Oh my god. I'm so sorry. But I thought of you making it. It made me sick. Okay, class, we have 10 minutes left, and I want you to fill out a questionnaire before you leave, okay? Look what my mom got me yesterday. I've been asking my mom to buy me one for months, and, and she said she will only get it for me for my birthday. But it's like, what, four months? I know, right? Now I'm stuck with this old iPhone 12. I'm so sorry to hear that. What are you gonna do with it? Play snake? I thought this went extinct together with the dinosaurs. <laughs> okay, girls. What's all the fuss about? I think we will have to get back to the paper questionnaires. There's no way Jolene even knows how to use a QR code. Very funny, girls. Jolene, come here. You can fill the questionnaire in my computer, okay? You know what? Maybe I will give you my iPhone 13 when my dad's gonna get me a new iPhone 14 in a couple of months. I'll consider this a charity. Out. Now. What did I do? You should always treat people with respect, you know, because you never know what situation they're going through. Now I think it's best if you go out and you rethink your actions. And I never want to hear you saying these things in the classroom again, okay? Fine. girl who even cares about her I mean, the teacher does <laughs> but why she still uses a button phone you can't get any more lame maybe she really can't afford a new one <laughs> yeah right you don't have to be a millionaire to afford a smartphone well 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 look what we have here <laughs> Bike's not good enough for ya, huh? Where did you get that thing from? Even our school janitor has a better one. <laughs> you lost something. Locking this bike? You really think someone might steal it from you? Then do get a wheelchair. No one's gonna try to steal it from under your ass. Pathetic. Then why are you watching? Don't you have anything better to do? Ah, oh, shit. of responsibility your shift started at 5 p.m. and what time did you get here six we had to close shop because of you do you know how much money we lost I'm sorry this will be deducted from your salary but but 
no buts, we have customers. Look who's here. What do you want? Don't need to be so rude. I wanted a sandwich, but I thought of you making it made me sick. Cool, so you can leave now. How dare you talk like that? Your boss was just here, should we call him back? <laughs> I guess you wouldn't want that. So make me a vanilla latte, please. Small, medium, large. I know you couldn't afford it because it seems that you wouldn't get paid today, but I just signed a contract in a law firm for an internship, so I can help myself with a large cup of coffee. <laughs> you really think you can save up for iPhone 14 working in this place? Maybe you will have enough when you retire, it will be as old as you then. <laughs> maybe if you showed up at work and treated your customers better, maybe then this jar wouldn't be so empty. <laughs> What's your problem? What did I ever do to you? You have no idea what me and my family are going through right now. The least you could do is show a little bit of respect. You know what? I wanted to give you a tip and help you out with the phone. But I wasn't happy with a customer experience in here. So you should just be happy that you are not fired yet. Sir, could I make an announcement? You have five minutes. Perfect, thank you, sir. Hey, everybody. So, as you might have heard, I'm organizing a party on Saturday. There's gonna be a pool, a lot of drinks, and snacks. And we booked the best DJ in the whole state. Everyone is invited, but we need to know how many people are gonna be there. So please scan the QR code on the invitations and reserve a spot. Let me guess. You're sorry I won't be able to attend. Um, <laughs> it's not like you got a new phone, I suppose. I wouldn't go to your party, even if I had one. Whatever you say. Let me know if you manage to get a new phone before Saturday. Maybe you will get lucky and there will still be a spot for you. Okay, this one still works. It's broken. And I know you don't want to ask her mom to pay, but... I'm afraid she'll get mad at me again, just like the last time. I won't let her beat you for this again. Give me five more days and I'll get you a new one, okay? Okay. And tell me if anybody bullies you at school again. You? Were you ooze dropping? I mean, no. My brother goes to this school. I'm sorry, I overheard a bit of your conversation. Cool. So now you have another reason to bully me in school. What? No. I mean, I, I didn't know. You didn't know what? Your situation. The situation doesn't matter. You can't bully others. Maybe I could have helped somehow. 
Like you've been helping before. Remember the day you made fun of me for my phone? I got a message from Katie saying that she was bullied and pushed down the stairs. I ran out of the class to call her and make sure she isn't hurt. The paper in the parking lot? I did some research on wheelchairs because I had to know which one I could afford. At first, I got a job at the cafe to save some money for a phone because I didn't want to be bullied. But when I found out what happened to Katie, I started saving money for a wheelchair because nothing is more important to me than my sister. That night after work, I was calling everyone to ask if they could help us with it, but no one could. The other morning I had coffee because I didn't sleep the whole night, but you spilled all of it and ruined all the information I had on wheelchairs. So I had to do it all over again. And that's why I was late to work on the day you came to the cafe. Do you have any sense of responsibility? Your spilled coffee cost me $200. We had to close the shop because of you. I'm so sorry. Just leave. I don't have the energy to get bullied today. charity. It's not a charity. Look, I know I've been a terrible person, but you told me that I should treat everyone with respect because you never know what they might be going through. And this wheelchair is the least I could do to make it up to you. I could give you a couple of my old phones if you like. And by old, I mean they're both iPhone 12. <laughs> is it a deal? And you can be on the VIP list to my party if you like. A sister too is invited. Can we? I've never been invited to a party before. Please. Okay, Katie, we can go. Would you like to try a new wheelchair? Mm -hmm. 